Hey, welcome back this morning. We're in the Gospel of Luke. It's a great place to start our day. We're going to start today in verses 33 through 35. Here they are. Then they said to him, Why do the disciples of John fast often and make prayers, and likewise those of the Pharisees, but yours eat and drink? And he said to them, Can, can you make the friends of the bridegroom fast while the bridegroom is with them? But the days will come when the bridegroom will be taken away from them. Then they will fast in those days. All right, so Jesus is getting an accusation now. Well, these other disciples, these disciples of John the Baptist, they're holier than yours because yours are eating and drinking. His, his are out there starving in the wilderness. Look at the Pharisees, you know, they're fasting and, and tell, they, the Pharisees like to tell us all about their fasting. Yes, we know quite well the Pharisees are fasting because they tell us about it all the time. But Jesus says, you know what? While the bridegroom is, is there, you know, we have to rejoice. There will be a time for fasting. And there were time, was time that came after for plenty of fasting. Uh, when Jesus is with us, we need to take full advantage of the opportunities. We want to be right, and so may the Lord help us to receive from him all that he has for us. There will be time for more fasting at another time. But you know what? Sometimes very few of us are fasting today. And we look at there's these guys trying to stir up trouble, comparing disciples among the different groups. And that's a problem when we begin to compare ourselves against others. You know what? The first business I have is to make sure that I'm right with Jesus. And after that, the Lord can sort out some of the other pieces. That's not my, I'm not called to that. I'm called to be right, and that's, that's enough. That's enough just to be right there. So let's make sure that we're right. Let's pray. Your Father in heaven, as we recognize uh, there are forces always at work to divide God's people to compare us, to lead us to compare each other among ourselves, uh, to introduce questions that are there not to help us. So, Lord, we want to be right. We want to see to our own things and make sure that our heart is right to you, our heart is submitted to you. And so we're looking for your help in these things, Lord. Uh, help us to have some discernment when people are trying to divide your people. Help us to understand that and not take the bait. Thank you for hearing our prayers, Lord. In Jesus' name, amen. Friends, there will be time for fasting, but if you're walking with Jesus, make sure, first of all, that you've been walking with Jesus and receiving all the help and the gifts that he has for us. We, we, we also should fast as the Lord shows us to. God bless you today.